I felt so overwhelmed by everything. As the day went on, the shaking and sweating got worse. As someone asked me what was wrong and started to cry, I couldn't control it. I went to counseling and saw my physician. After a couple weeks with the medication, I had control again and felt so much relief. I was always on the edge. I was very jumpy and reactive, and I would lose my breath when I talked to people. After a month with therapy and medication, I felt like I could breathe again. I was able to work on some coping techniques that really helped me feel better. These are the voices of people who have found medication to be an important part of helping them with anxiety. Everyone has experienced some kind of anxiety. Sometimes it's just worry about what other people might think of you, about personal plans, or the future. Other times it feels more like agitation, irritability, or even sadness. Sometimes anxiety can affect more than just how you think or feel. The physical symptoms of anxiety can be overwhelming and feel hard to control. These include rapid breathing and heart rate, sweating, trembling hands and feet, excessive tearfulness, a lump in the throat, problems with digestion, like feeling sick to your stomach and a constant headache. They often make anxious feelings worse. The experience can feel so bad that a person can dread it happening again, which only increases the worry and can even result in a panic attack. Cognitive behavioral therapy and medication are both effective treatments for symptoms of anxiety, especially when used at the same time. It's important to know a little about the different kinds of medication for anxiety. Selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or SSRIs, and serotonin and norepinephrine reuptake inhibitors, or SNRIs, are the most common and effective medications for both anxiety and depression. SSRI and SNRIs are taken daily, are effective for long-term treatment, and help reduce symptoms such as irritability, agitation, frequent crying, and excessive worry. SSRIs, or SNRIs, are not addictive and do not result in substance use disorder. Benzodiazepines, commonly known as benzos, are fast-acting medications commonly used to treat significant anxiety symptoms and panic attacks. While effective, these medications can be addictive. They should never be taken in combination with alcohol or opioids, and should only be used as directed by a physician. Safe use of benzodiazepines can be effective for anxiety symptoms, but should only be used in close collaboration with a doctor and as part of a larger wellness plan. Beta blockers are a type of medication usually used for high blood pressure or uneven heartbeat. They can also be effective for short-term reduction of anxiety symptoms related to heart rate, sweating, or shakiness. Some specific prescription antihistamines can also be used in a similar short-term manner. These medications can be used on an as-needed basis, especially when specific situations like flying impact someone's life. Each class of medication for anxiety has different benefits and risks, and each can offer relief for anxiety symptoms that get in the way of day-to-day -day life. Most primary care providers are familiar with these medications, which, in combination with cognitive behavioral therapy, are effective treatments for anxiety disorders. Anxiety symptoms can be overwhelming, but with the right treatment, anxiety can be manageable for almost anyone. Physical symptoms can be reduced, and you can learn positive coping strategies for long-term success. People literally breathe easier and learn to feel hope again. <laughs>